Ciao Oda. My name is Margherita. I'm in my third week of lockdown in the north of Italy. Of course, I feel extremely lucky. We don't live in a city, so we have a bit of green outside um, and we definitely take advantage of it, especially with the kids. It's extremely helpful at this time. Um, but I'm still trying to embrace this situation as much as I can. I think fighting it would be completely um, exhausting and useless. I'm trying to take advantage of the moments that this slower pace allows me. I'm picking wild salad. I'm doing creative little things with my kids. We put on a, a full atelier on the dining table and we work together every day. I'm finally wearing my um, spot covering spot covering stars on my forehead, which I never dared wearing actually outside, but I'm really digging in this time. Um, and um, I'm still working quite a bit. We have new uh, systems that allow us to work remotely. Yesterday we did the whole fittings of the knitwear and um, today I worked on the glasses collection approvals. Um, but it definitely has a, a, a different pace, which is much more human. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm really appreciating. So I think we will take some of the, some of the things away from the situation and carry them in our post-corona life such as working remotely um, in some cases, such as um, keeping a little bit of time for passions, for to make things with our hands, to um, rediscover kettle bushes, to make soup. Um, you know, I this time it's so weird because in a way we're in a little bubble here with my husband and two children and there's no one else that I need and we managed to have so in a way this feels really surreal because I'm here in a kind of bubble with my husband and children nobody else that I need and in our beautiful home uh, with a garden so it feels weird, but we're happy. And then there's everything else that's happening outside with the hospitals collapsing, people dying, um, doctors struggling, and it's literally, you know, a few hundred meters away. So what could I do for my home? Not much, but... Um, when I saw the success of this little charity sale I did last week with Vestiaire, when I saw the success it had, I immediately thought, let's sell everything that I have for sale on Vestiaire um, to support the hospitals in Regione Lombardia. And that's what I did. So uh, more than 200 pieces are for sale now and they're actually selling really fast. I'm really happy about it. Um, in the end, I'll let you guys know how much I made in total for them.